Hello, my name's Mark Patterson and I'm a veterinary cardiology specialist based at HeartVets in Gloucestershire. I just wanted to take the next couple of minutes to talk about heart disease in large breed dogs so that you can take the relevant steps in helping your dog to stay healthy. Just like humans, dogs can suffer from heart disease. The most common type of heart disease in large breed dogs is called dilated cardiomyopathy or DCM for short. DCM is a disease that affects the heart muscle and its ability to pump blood around the body. DCM most commonly affects large breed dogs such as, but not exclusively, Dobermans, Boxers, Great Danes and Irish Wolfhounds. For example, up to half of all Dobermans will develop DCM in their lifetime. Sadly, large breed dogs with DCM are at risk of sudden death. In DCM, the heart muscle gradually becomes weakened and floppy and becomes very inefficient at pumping blood around the body. DCM is characterised by two phases, a long and silent preclinical phase, where the dog will appear normal and healthy, and then a shorter clinical phase, i.e. heart failure, where the dog appears ill. The preclinical phase is important because although your pet may look healthy, the changes of heart disease have already begun. Unfortunately, once clinical signs are noted, the disease tends to progress quickly. The good news is that if DCM is detected in the preclinical phase, there are options for managing your dog's condition before they progress into heart failure. So as a large breed owner, how would you know if your dog has DCM? During the preclinical phase of DCM, your dog will generally look and act happy and healthy. With the silent nature of this disease, heart screening is the only real way to detect it. Finding DCM early enables your vet to institute an optimal management program, which can help to extend your dog's life. It's advised that at-risk dogs, i.e. large breed dogs over 20 kilos and over three years old, undergo heart screening. During heart screening, your vet may want to run one or more tests, typically including a blood test and or a heart scan. Depending on the results of each test, your vet may then suggest a treatment regimen if appropriate or testing again as needed. Annual checkups are key in protecting the hearts of at-risk dogs. Just because a dog doesn't have DCM at one checkup doesn't mean that they won't develop it at a later stage. So to summarise, heart disease can develop in at-risk dogs even when they seem happy and healthy. Please don't delay in talking to your veterinary surgeon. They will be best placed to advise you on heart screening and the potential options to keep your pet as happy and healthy for as long as possible.